And the Queenslanders fear, and Jared Hayne has the potential to be the Blues X Factor on Wednesday night, even playing on the wing. And Hayne says he won't be changing his game or his attitude, despite being labelled arrogant. The Hayne plane was left in the hangar for game one. With the series on the line, he's back in blue. He admits he's been bruised by the verbal battering he's copped. As a player, it's disappointing, you know, because obviously fans read a lot, you know, about that and, and um, you know, most of it's, you know, rubbish. So I guess, you know, if it was true, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be here. Yeah, I mean, look, arrogance in you. I mean, you've got to have a degree of arrogance to be a good footballer, don't you, and, and to be the best at what you do. Yeah, exactly. And, um, you know, it's confidence as well. So it's, um, it's something that, you know, I didn't really look much into. And... Are you hard to handle? Um... No, I don't think so. Haynes' body language has also been criticised. You're in the heat of the moment, you know, it's, uh, it's a tough sport we play and, you know, I guess, you know, when you come off, you know, everyone's, everyone's still mates and you know, everyone just has the desire to win and, um, you know, some players, you know, react differently. And to help him through every situation, Hayne has his faith. I've got a good, good faith, not, it's not so much religious, it's just a faith, so, it, um... Yeah, you know, obviously he has helped me over these, you know, last couple of weeks have been pretty tough, but, um, you know, I've really ma maintained my focus and, you know, just, just realised what I've got to do. You know, I just, just got to play football, you know, enjoy myself. Hopefully his teammates will follow Haynes' lead, but there are some worrying signs. 